Hi guys, my name is Gia, and I'm a vegan bodybuilder. Welcome. Thanks for joining me and Beyonce today. <laughs> uh, I Guys, I get a lot of questions on Facebook, Instagram, and Snapchat. And sometimes the answers are just way too long for me to address in those platforms. So I, I use YouTube as my medium to share more detail, provide more insight to uh, those answers. So today's video is going to be around what bars do I eat? What has good protein? Why do I eat it? Blah, blah, blah. Um, I have tried a ton of bars in my lifetime, I swear to you. <laughs> These are the ones that I, um, I, I swear by. Um, I'm kind of bummed out though, there's one brand that I'm out of and um, only because I love them so much I just gorged it all <laughs> and that's Amrita. So let's go ahead and start with Amrita bars. I'm going to pull video from maybe Instagram stories and kind of just talk through them. I don't know what content I'm going to pull so bear with me. The reason guys I like um, Amrita bars is because all of their ingredients are natural foods. It's dates, it's cashews, it's pineapple, it's cacao, it's maca, um, depending on the different flavors. The reason I really love Amrita, guys, is they have so many flavors and the texture is just so amazing. If you have a sweet tooth, I use Amrita as one of the ways for me to satisfy my sweet tooth cravings. And I, and Generally speaking, if I recall off the top of my head, Amrita protein bars have about 15 grams of protein, 30 grams of carbs, say 8 grams of fat somewhere hovering around there. Yeah, I gotta eat them a lot. Um, but I first fell in love with Amrita. I went to a random store, I think I was traveling, and I um, tried their um, chocolate maca, and they had actual like chocolate in it. <laughs> so I really love Amrita. For a lot of these, for some of these bars, guys, I do have coupon codes that you can use. I'll, um, I'll link everything in the description box below, but I'll also use, put the coupon codes here. Bling! <laughs> so you can use them if you want to try them out. Um, but I love Amrita. I also love Amrita because of the story of how Amrita started. Um, so take a look at their website and get to learn the, the brand a little bit more. But it was essentially a father that was trying to um, address an illness that his son had and was able to do it by... Um, oh, I'm getting goosebumps. <laughs> um, uh, by by creating foods that were more natural or, or having his son eat less processed foods and came birth of Amrita, um, Amrita bars. So um, I hope that's helpful. Um, so... I, I have to say, fair warning guys, if I didn't mention it already, when I eat bars, I don't eat them for the purpose, I, I don't like to use bars as my main source of protein, like I don't think like for me to get my protein, I have to eat protein bars or protein shakes, no, I actually get the majority of my protein from wheat gluten, um, which I'll link down below the playlist of like the food and recipes that I have um, created so far. Um, but protein bars are, <laughs> the protein bars I eat are because I either am, and so, I am so on the go sometimes that I just don't have time to actually get a meal, uh, which happens every now and again. Um, but more importantly because I just crave them because they're so good. <laughs> Anywho, <laughs> such is my life. Um, here's a, another protein, uh, another bar that I like, guys. I hope I'm not butchering their name. Um, Velo Bar, and I'll give you guys close-ups of these in just a bit. But the reason I like Velo Bar, guys, is it is freaking delicious. Um, now, Velo Bar also has CBD in it. For those that are not familiar, it's a cannabinoid. It comes from the same plant as uh, hemp, or, or as marijuana, the, I believe the hemp plant. Um, it is not a hallucinogenic, it will not get you high, it is completely legal, um, you don't have to worry about it. The reason that CBD is helpful, cannabinoids is helpful, is because um, they're told to help uh, your muscles heal and relax um, without, you know, kind of the need for other medicines and helping you repair and kind of just calm, uh, be in a state of calm without getting high. I'm going to try to do a close-up shot, guys, of... Um, trying to break these bars open for you so you kind of know what you're seeing here. Um, Vila Bar, guys, um, 
is really great with the texture. You could see that chunk of chocolate right there. Um, it's amazing. Now, Vila Bar, uh, the, I'm going to try to read this backwards here. The total fat is 15 grams, the protein is 7 grams, and the carbs is, where are you, carbs? 19 grams. Now, I, with 15 grams of fat, for, for what I'm particularly trying to accomplish and just kind of my body and the way my body metabolizes right now in this part of the year, I'm not prepping for a competition, um, 15 grams of fat is too much for me as a post-workout, right? So what I actually like to do, especially because I have my majority of my cravings, sweet cravings late at night, is I'll eat it at nighttime because 15 grams of fat is great um, for me before I go to sleep because it helps to slow down my digestion and make sure that I'm digesting at an even pace through the evening while I'm sleeping. Hope that makes sense. Uh, another one that I love, guys, is Nugo. Uh, Nugo Slim. It's a vegan. Uh, you're you're gonna see, you're gonna see a trend. Chocolate, dark chocolate peanut butter. Uh, this bar has seven grams of fat, eighteen grams of carbs, seventeen grams of protein. The reason I like this bar, guys, is for a protein bar, it's actually pretty friendly on the macros, and I like it because <laughs> chocolate. <laughs> because there's chocolate all over the place. Um, and while it looks all plain and bland on the outside, oh gosh, on the inside, there's all, all sorts of goodness. I'm gonna take a bite. <laughs> I've been wanting to take a bite of these bars since I bought them for you guys today, this, this morning, but I've been holding off for this video. <laughs> so, Nugo is a great snack bar for me. Um, if I have it, it's not a meal replacement. None of these are strictly meal replacements for me. Um, I still very much believe that I will get a ton of more minerals and vitamins from real, um, uh, from, from vegetables, all that stuff. So even if I'm just having a bar, I will have some sort of vegetable. I might have a bell pepper and I'll munch on it or uh, another, a piece of fruit or something to, to munch on it. Um, so Nugo is great. Uh, if I have that this uh, this bar here, um, I will make sure that I eat something else with it because it is not enough for me for a meal. Uh, the next bars that I have, guys, come from No Cow. <laughs> I'm laughing because <laughs> guess the flavors: chocolate fudge brownie bar, peanut butter. <laughs> chocolate chip bar. Ooh, chocolate. Um, I'll go through these one by one. I love no cow. Now, if you're looking for a protein protein bar, this is my go-to guy here. And the reason I think is pretty clear and simple based on the macronutrients. Oops, sorry. Total fat is 7 grams, total carbs is 24 grams, and total protein is 21 grams of um, protein. Now, that's of the ma uh, 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 for what my body needs, this is great. Um, I will still eat more carbs than that, um, but this is great for me in just um, being able to get protein down quickly. And if, especially if I'm in a rush and I, I can't get to a proper meal, um, no cow uh, does try to do provide texture within each of the bars. It isn't quite like the other bars, um, but as you can see. It's a little bit more protein powdery texture, if that makes sense. And I really like No Cow because it's one of those protein bars that isn't hard to chew into. Have you, you ever had a protein bar and you feel like you're breaking your jaw? So that's the chocolate, chocolate fudge brownie one. This is the peanut butter chocolate chip one. This is my favorite. Of the no cow bars they have way more flavors than this they have like lemon raspberry blueberry I think they just came out with a coconut um, and then they just came out with these bars that have caffeine in them but these are these are just my go-to's I could spend hours talking about different bars 
This is the peanut butter one. The peanut butter one um, has 6 grams of fat, 25 grams of carbs, and 20 grams of protein. Um, one less gram of fat as well as protein, but it's not a big deal in my opinion. This is my favorite one just because I really, really love the texture. I'm going to go ahead and take the camera off of the stand. I'm going to try to give you guys a better shot of these broken up bars. <laughs> Okay guys, that's it. I hope that was helpful. If uh, you have any more questions, put it in the comments below. Um, if there's something that you want me to get into greater detail to, just let me know. If this kind of stuff is helpful, let me know by hitting the like button, thumbs up button, whatever that button is. <laughs> if you want to see more content from this mug, hit the subscribe button. There's a notification bell somewhere, ding, 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 ding. I don't know where it is, but you can click it. All right, guys, that's it. Um, and if you're not already following me on Snapchat, Instagram, and Facebook, hey. here they are. <laughs> okay, guys, have a good day. See ya.